and one of the most popular competitors in the women's division. The following contest is a fatal four-way tables, ladders, and chairs match. And is for the SmackDown Women's Championship. Introducing the challenger from Elmwood Park, New Jersey, Liv Morgan. Don't let the bubbly personality fool you. Liv is for real. A proven talent inside the ring, one of the most beloved competitors around. The man is here. A competitor who never backs down from a fight. And introducing the challenger from Dublin, Ireland, Becky Lynch. From underdog to the top of the food chain. Becky Lynch is ready for a fight and ready to put everyone on notice. It is amazing in such a short period of time, Becky Lynch has become one of the most popular superstars in WWE. A woman who demands the spotlight and deserves it. And introducing the challenger from Montreal, Quebec, Canada, Maurice. Maurice had one of the longest championship reigns of all time. An A-lister in her own right. Why does Maurice always feel it's necessary to inform the world that they're not allowed in her personal space? Because Maurice feels necessary to inform the entire world that they're not as good as she is. Well, there's a humble attitude. It's a sad facts of life, Saxton. She has a very questionable attitude. There's nothing to question, Byron. The baddest woman on the planet, Ronda Rousey. We're about to see a throwdown. And introducing the champion from Venice Beach, California. The SmackDown Women's Champion, the baddest woman on the planet, Ronda Rousey. She went undefeated for a year in WWE and is ready to continue her domination. Rousey's not paid by the hour, and I got a feeling she's going to end this quick. Big fight feel as these women battle for the SmackDown Women's Championship in this always chaotic TLC rules match with Liv Morgan, Becky Lynch, Maurice, and Ronda Rousey. No competitor can go more than two feet without being met with a foreign object. So many lethal weapons in a TLC match. And it doesn't matter where you are in this match. Even the title above the ring can be used as a weapon. There's nowhere to escape the dangers. In a match like this, sometimes the smartest strategy is to find an ally. It can also be the most dangerous if you don't watch your back. Face Buster! Kick to the gut. Hammerlock applied. Suplex! So what's the key to making it out of a TLC match in one piece? If you want to win, you need to leave any hesitation behind and just lean into the stipulation. This match was created to cause chaos, so cause it. Bang! 
And each of these lethal maneuvers have got to be taking a toll. Put in a position now. Ooh, pinpointing the trachea. Should have blacked out for that attack. She's not smiling now. That attack was definitely pre-calculated, hoping to greatly diminish the power in that arm. You have to question what kind of malintent is behind a power bomb with that much force. Boom. Liv 
just looking to humiliate her opponent. Oh, hello. Morgan on the receiving end. She sent back in under the ropes. Taking it to the floor. What's she going to do? Suicide down. Whatever it takes to win. And an elbow. The jumping complete shot. Face first. That will hinder her competition from getting anywhere near a ladder now. These women have not given each other any breathing room. No one is showing any signs of backing down. has that jersey toughness accompanied with a jersey mouth. Boom, head first. Boom, head first. Rousey scoops up her opponent. Rousey Buster. All right, Rousey with a big takedown. Now going to turn into a Looking for the full arm extension to complete the submission. Well, this won't win the match, but it's one way to inflict a great... De she's tapping, she's tapping, but it doesn't matter at all in this situation. The WWE Universe showing the love for these superstars who have given them so much tonight. And you can tell there are cruel intentions in mind right now. Starting to think she might have this one in the bag. Letting her opponent know she is ready for anything. Yeah. Tilt the wall head scissors. She's got her cinched in. Well executed suplex. With no count outs, there's nothing keeping her inside the ring. Liv just looking to humiliate her opponent. She goes back inside the ropes. To the gut. Here we go. Ryan Piper's pit. Oof. Running knee in the corner. Oh, man. Inverted backbreaker. Ow. Uh, using a handful of hair to deliver the snapmare. And this is even worse, my goodness! Sight set on the top rope. Oh, look at this here, arm wrench! Ooh. Around the neck. Moves outside. What's the plan here? Coming back into the ring. Back to the action. Carefully. She's getting that ladder position perfectly. Well, setting it up is one thing. Climbing it is entirely different. Big opportunity here, guys. This could be a turning point. Her time could be now. Just has to pull it down. Not about you guys, but this 
this looks like quite a gamble to take at this point in the match. I agree with you, Corey. Oh, she continues the fight high above the ring. Just relentless. She slips outside. What has she got in mind? Getting around in position now. Smack down in the center of the ring, too, Corey. And these attacks are spelling nothing but trouble. And Ann is within reach here for one of these superstars. If this doesn't end in a crash back down to the mat. Me too! Oh, God. Oh, this is where things really start to get interesting, guys. Yeah, you say interesting. I say ridiculous. No count out as she takes this fight to the floor. And this one might be headed ringside. She's looking to climb the ladder here. She's going to have to move quick. Here we go. Making that all important climb up the ladder. I think this is... Maurice. Well, Becky Lynch shuts down all uncertainty. She is now champion. Here is your winner. And the new SmackDown Women's Champion, Becky Lynch. She won the title. She's the champ. She came into this match on a mission. And now we have to say it. Mission accomplished.